Public Provident Fund or simply PPF is a popular investment plan backed by the sovereign guarantee from the Indian government which seems to offer you a very high maturity amount after a certain number of years. Those are a lot of good things to hear in a single sentence. But is the PPF scheme as good as it sounds? Let's find out. A PPF scheme is a savings plan where you put some amount of money every year and you will earn about 8% compound interest on the total amount in the account. This savings plan has a lock-in period of 15 years but you can extend it to 20 years to earn more interest. If you invest a maximum amount of 1.5 lakhs per year to your PPF account, you would have deposited 22 lakhs in the regular plan and 30 lakhs in the extended plan. But what will be the maturity amount in both cases? You will get a maturity amount of about 42 lakhs from the regular plan and about 70 lakhs from the extended plan. That sounds amazing. It looks like the money has doubled. But before we get excited, there are two things that we are forgetting about these big numbers. Inflation and other investment tools. Talking about other investment options, it must be clear that a return of about 8% from a PPF account is not even close to the returns from other investment tools like from stocks and mutual funds, which may offer up to 20% of returns annually. So if you were thinking that the maturity amount from a PPF account was big, then it should be clear that the same amount of money invested in mutual funds or stocks will be much higher than that from the PPF scheme. But even if you don't feel like investing in stocks and mutual funds, and if you think that you are satisfied with the double returns from the PPF scheme, then you, my friend, are wrong. You see, the value of money depreciates with time. What may seem like a big maturity amount today might actually be just a small amount 20 years down the line. Let's calculate how much it would actually be. Adjusting for an average inflation rate of 3% each year, the maturity amount from PPF about 20 years from now is effectively just 40 lakh rupees as of today. So clearly, when we were thinking before that we were doubling our money using the PPF account, it was just an illusion. In fact, the money increases only by a small percentage. So if we are practically not earning any significant amount of money from our PPF account, then why should we even bother investing in it? If we talk in terms of finance alone, it is evident that other investment options are clear winners. But how good are they for retirement? Now even though the returns from a PPF scheme are not magnificent, it just may be the perfect tool for retirement. Let me explain. Every investment tool out there has a purpose, to fulfill a particular need of the investor. In most cases, one investment tool cannot replace another. Each one has its own advantages and disadvantages. You can try to save your money for retirement from investments in stocks or mutual funds, or even just save hard cash at home or in your bank account. Well, trust me, that won't happen. Not now, not anytime soon. In fact, just think about how much money have you already saved for your retirement till now. I guess you know now that the answer is not so good. This is the only thing that a PPF account is good for. You can never save for retirement if you choose share market or mutual funds as the option, since these are highly liquid options. This means that you can spend them easily. Whenever you need to buy a new car, a new house, or money to cure a critical illness, or a hundred other things that you want to do, where do you think you will get all of this money from? It will be from your highly liquid investments and savings. Using traditional savings options, you can never save money for your future because you will always have more expenses and less money to cover them. Retirement money is just too easy to compromise. But in case of such an emergency, a PPF account is the last place you will come to cash out your money. This is because you cannot touch your money for up to 20 years in a PPF scheme. Unless you have critical complications relating to your health or education, you won't be allowed any sort of premature withdrawal from your account. Probably this is why a PPF account beats every other sort of investment because it guarantees that you have some corpus left for your retirement and because it stands the test of time. 
We hope that we were able to show you the reality of the PPF scheme in India. If you liked this video, do give it a thumbs up and maybe even help your friends and family gain some investment knowledge by sharing this video with them. We suggest you click the subscribe button down below and hit the bell icon so that you don't miss out any of our videos on investor education like this one. Thank you for watching till the end.